In this video, I'm going to show you how to compare two different JSON files using Visual Studio Code. Now, the use case is basically, uh, say, let's assume uh, if you have a Power Automate flows and you are authoring a Power Automate flow and you have did, you did a couple of runs on that Power Automate flow. So in, in my case, I have this Power Automate flow and I have run this Power Automate flow and I've run it two times you know now if i want to compare what was the json output during those run uh, what i'm going to do is like i'm going to go inside the flow and uh, i'm going to observe it okay so uh, i'll see that okay this flow has run successfully but then the, the output which was generated from two different flows were different so um, so take for example if i click on list rows and i see show raw output okay so here i get a set of json okay now this json the output which has been generated over here and the json which is outputted in the another run will be different okay so what i need to do is like i need to just copy this json put it in a file and then i need to compare this and see the difference okay so what i've done ahead of time is i have already created that two json file so let me open uh, visual studio code and if you don't know how to use visual studio code or download visual studio code you can go to the website and download this uh, application it's free of cost uh, so what you need to do is you need to open the folder where your json file resides so let me open the folder so i'm opening a c girish folder in my uh, machine and there are two json files which is present in this particular folder so the two json file which is over here so let me show you it's called json a and json b okay so json a looks something like this and json b looks something like this okay now you need to compare json a and json b so how do you go ahead and do that okay so first what you need to do is like you need to select the first json file and right click and say this is the one you want to compare okay so you'll say select for compare so i've selected this one for comparison then you go into the target file, the JSON B dot JSON, the another JSON file, right click it. And now this time, don't say select for compare, just say compare with selected. Okay. The moment you do that, see what happens over here. Okay. So let me first close this tab, just one. Now this says it is comparing JSON A dot JSON with JSON B dot JSON. So my two JSON file is now getting compared. Okay. Now, if you want a more real estate, you can, you know, uh, again, click over here in this icon and then you get more real estate. Now, how you compare both the file? First, you go line by line. You say, okay, this line does not have any highlight. So that means this line is intact in both the file. The moment you come over here, you see that line number 10. Okay. Line number 10 has framework in it and here it has framework.net okay so that means that's one of the difference then you see that line number 12 this line exists over here this line doesn't exist in json b dot json and that's why we can see that oh this may be not the part of the output okay uh, from here again you can see those difference in this line uh, although this line exists but then the value is different over here uh, and there are a couple of uh, parameters which are missing in json b dot json file okay so so that's how you basically compare two different JSON files. And then if you scroll side by side, you will see that uh, the differences. Okay. Now, in most of the document, there's no not much difference except for the one which we have seen in the uh, top over here. Okay. So you can see the exactly the line number where these changes uh, are. Okay. So that's it, folks. This is how you basically compare two different files uh, using Visual Studio Code. Thanks for watching.